What's going on, guys? Um, I thought I'd go ahead and make a, a video of, um, for Timothy Bradley. You know, he had that fight fight last week against, uh, what was it, Carlos, uh, Luis, Ar Arbregu, whatever his name is. You guys know who he is. You know what I'm talking about. Fought last week on HBO. Uh, that was, he debuted on, I think he even debuted on HBO. I ain't never seen a fight on HBO. He's normally fighting on Showtime. And then... Uh, he stepped up to uh, 147. Previously, before that, you know, I gave him a hard time on his headbutts because that motherfucker, the motherfucker headbutt your ass. That motherfucker can knock you stupid. And then these guys that he's fighting, once they get headbutted more than once or whatever, they have to be leery of his head plus his, plus his fist. So, you know, you know, you, 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 you making a guy fight differently after you, after they feel that head. Um, but besides all that, I, I thought he showed growth when he followed Mark Peterson. There wasn't no clash of heads. He showed tremendous boxing skills. He looked real good. You know, he, did, he looked good. I'm not going to hate on him. He did look good. Um, but I'm not going to lie. This last fight he just had, man, he did not look good at all. Personally, he didn't look good to me. Um, and, and what will make it so bad is he had the nerve to call him Manny Pacquiao. I'm like, dude, you're not even near that level. You, it, it like he took a step backwards that fight to me personally. I mean, he was punching with his eyes closed. He was trying to trade. He was th he was winging punches, leaving his dude. He left himself open so many times. And if he steps in the ring with a guy like Manny Pacquiao, dude, you going to sleep? And I think Manny Pacquiao take him out in under three rounds, easy, because of the cut because he leaves himself wide open. Um, I don't think he's on that level. He still has a lot to work on uh, personally. Uh, he got bad habits, man. His bad habits will will catch up with him. He's not real good at taking us uh, uh, punches. Um, he's been floored, you know. Manny Pacquiao, dude, he's just he's a beast, man. You, you can't fuck with no Manny. Um, he's punching with his eyes closed. He kept trying to trade. Every time the guy threw punches, he was throwing punches, and he was throwing punches with his eyes closed. Like that's scary. You just you throwing punches, man, with your eyes closed. I think after the second or third round, he hit uh, Arbery Goo or whatever his fucking name is. He hit him with a right hand punch, man. He threw a jab, jab, and he and he and he reached with the right hand. His eyes was fucking closed. Like, dude, you, you just amateur shit, man. Uh, this is this bad. He looked bad, man. For them guys that like Timothy Bradley, he looked bad. I like I, I do like Timothy Bradley. But you know, <clears throat> he got a lot of work on. He ain't ready for no uh uh I think he needs to move down to uh 140. He's too small for 147. He I can't see him beating nobody in that weight division. Uh he need to go ahead and fight Devin Alexander, to be honest with you. He, I don't think he can whoop Devin Alexander. And to be honest with you, I think Devin Alexander probably knock him out. Personally, I do. I think he knocked him out. Uh, that boy tough. I think he need to go back to 140 uh, and and, cl and clean up, do a little bit more house cleaning. You know, you got uh, Madonna, you got Devin, and I think you know uh, Berto will come down. I want to see you fight with Berto. You know, whoop these guys and then holler out Manny Pacquiao, Floyd Mayweather, man. Until then, man, you gotta you gotta make a statement. Well, you gotta make a statement with a, with a, with, a, with with some more names, man. Before you before you before Manny Pacquiao or Floyd Mayweather or, or anybody will even step in the ring with you, uh, you know. And I don't think they'll be scared to step in the ring with you, knowing that you're gonna make those kind of mistakes, winging punches with your eyes closed and, and leaving yourself wide open. Dude, he left he left himself open all day. Dude, he looked bad. But I'm not gonna spend too much time on this. Uh, I didn't really want to make a video on him because, you know, he didn't look all that, but I had to. Anyway, that's my take on Timothy Bradley, the Desert Storm, a.k.a. Heady Monster, the Headbutt King.